that looks like it goes down that way. Yeah. If I lie down, yeah. with, with, if my body does that. <laughs> lady that I've known for how long have we known each other now? Five years. Five, six years. Um, her name is Lila Mimic. Uh, so I've, I've, I've brought this up in the podcast but I always like talking about how we met because it's like it's quite different to how I meet everyone else. I've never met anybody like this. Yeah. I know mean, we're only like 20, Roller coaster, in our 20s but like you know. yeah yeah yeah. Yeah yeah it was um it was it was at Spotlight Studios. Yeah, Spotlight. Spotlight. yeah 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 yeah. Um, and what had happened, we were both going for a role, not the same role, and um, yeah, like, we we just ended up chatting, um, in, like, we were waiting for a casting, and you went in to the casting, and, like, I was, like, so compelled to think, this person is fucking awesome, I had so much fun with her, for this, like, ten minutes that we've been sitting, like, together, I, I went up to the receptionist, and was like, can I have a bit of paper and a pen, please? And she was like, why? And I'm like, I just pen and paper, please. <laughs> wrote, wrote my name down. Sean Joseph Young. <laughs> Sean Joseph Young. Sean Joseph Young. <laughs> Find me on Facebook. Oh my God, yeah. And creepily placed it inside your pocket. <laughs> <laughs> I remember when I found that, it was like, this has never happened to me before. Right. It was like, it's a very unique experience. Yeah, it was, I was either going to write it in pen or blood, and I'm really glad that I went with pen. Yeah, or your yeah. name. Or you're, yeah, yeah, just really damp. Yeah. Excuse me, can I borrow some paper? <laughs> do you need a pen? No, no, I do not. I, I, I'm always curious how you felt when I had given you that. Very hon- honestly, I was like, oh, that's, it was, it was like a lovely pick me up. It was a mm. genuine pick me up. And it was also, mm. then it, it wasn't like, yeah. Like, as in, we actually then became friends. Another one. <laughs> yeah, sure. Uh, what? Whatever. Still five years later, the only one. The right. only one. Oh, okay. Yeah, um, yeah. Yeah, I think you were like, she's crazy, but. I think we were okay with that. Most people yeah. like she's crazy, slowly but surely creep away. <laughs> well, uh, that's what I did as soon as I put it in your jacket. I went, you <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like mine, great. <laughs> um, but uh, no, it was lovely. And then we actually, I think I remember, oh, a bit personal here, but then I think we both went through a breakup. So then we yeah, had to like, yeah. and then it was very, and there was that like awful thing where you were telling me the side of how you felt about something. And I was like, oh, fuck, maybe that's what my boyfriend thinks. Then you do you want to go into that? No, no. no. <laughs> I, think we're, I think we're okay. I mean, it was a while ago. It was a while like, ago. Yeah. It was a while ago. I, but yeah, yeah. But that was weird because then we ended up just like, I remember having just long conversations with you about kind of like the opposite side of the situation. Mm, mm. Yeah. It was just kind of like... like... I was just like, oh, my girlfriend's dead and you were like, yeah, I'd killed my boyfriend. Yeah. It's very similar yeah, things. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's yeah. good to see the other side. Yeah. Yeah. Murderer, M- murdered. Murdering. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Murdering. Yeah. Murdering. Lovely. Yeah, Lovely. yeah. That's the name of my next album. Murder. Um, <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, no, it was, it was, it was crazy. It was. I mean, obviously, I had hundred percent manufactured the whole relationship just so I could this, break this, up when you break great, up. Great, great. And be like, well, now, now here's my chance. We're both heartbroken. <laughs> get, just, get them when we're both weak. <laughs> we're just like really vulnerable like, yeah. in our hometown. It's like, oh God, oh God. Oh, maybe we'll find love one day. <laughs> oh God, it was so bleak. How yeah. We were like 19. 19, we? yeah. yeah. Yeah, no, it was horrible. It was not but pleasant. It, at least we came closer, but we still didn't see each other, but you know. No, it was, it was, it yeah, was a it was virtual like, relationship. Let's, let's, keep, let's keep this sort of distance. It's bubbling. Yeah. It's bubbling. Yeah. Once yeah. a year, please. <laughs> I think we're like, I always think about it. This is not a panel that you can um, engage with, but mm. I always think like with breakups and stuff, it's like it's like when you're in your period, as in when you're going through it, mm. it's the worst thing in the world. Yeah, yeah. And as an old, as like somebody who's on the outside, you're like you you could like have sympathy, yeah. But you kind of forget what it's like, and then when you're in your period or you're breaking up, you're like. This is the worst yeah. thing in the world. I've got to text all my friends who've gone through this and been like, I'm mm. now going through it. Oh my fucking God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so I kind of always, yeah. So you're kind of finding some sort of kind it's of... It's very, yeah. I'm very close to the whole period thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Insane. Insane, yeah. Insane. Yeah, I, I, I feel sad at the same time you do, <laughs> weirdly, every month. <laughs> when, when, I, when I'm ovulating, I'm like, sure, this is bad time. Yeah, yeah, This is uh, bad time. And then I text you going, oh, my stomach hurts. <laughs> Yeah, I, but I don't think I could ever do what you did. I don't think ever in my life I could What's write, that? write if I saw somebody and write. Oh, do you know what? I've never done it since. I've okay. never done it since. So have you never, have you never like gone up to someone and been like? Um, 
Just do that. Yeah, just a few... You and I. A few fluid dance moves. Yeah. Um, you and I, pushing rod. Yeah, no, I don't think I have. I think... Um, should I think of a met people? I've, I've like met people that I'm like, I think you kind of can sometimes see me go, oh, you're a sort of vibe that we should be fine together, mm, mm. like m- friendship wise or whatever. Yeah. And then, and then you just kind of like, I get then get very, very open too quickly. And I'm like, I think you're fucking amazing. Mm. And then it's a little bit oppressive. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so I've had to like tone that down a bit. Yeah. Um, yeah, but that I think I think I think it's just a very brave thing to do. Also, I think it's probably and I hate using this fucking gender thing, but I think it's often the men who. It's often like, and I don't think that's good, but often mm. that I think that's kind of the way. Oh, how long have you been with your boyfriend now? Oh my god, so maybe four, four and a half years. How do you keep that alive? <laughs> <laughs> You're almost choked on that. <laughs> oh my god! You sick? How do you keep that alive? Um, what's uh, the key? What's, what's the, key the key to a, to a long lasting um, relationship? Um, so we have a rule, and it's half uh, it's half in jest. Mm. I don't think it's in jest. It's no murdering before eleven o'clock. There's no murdering. Yeah. There's no you know slave owner. And then basically, the, 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 we have one agreement, which is if he has to make me laugh every day. Right. If he doesn't, then it's over. Shit, okay. Yeah, wow. so, I mean, kind of in jest, but, yeah. so then... <laughs> kind of in jest, but it is... Kind it of is like, like, I wait patiently, mm. and then, um, so that's, I think that's one thing, always laughing. Yeah. Um, and then, what's the, yeah, I mean, I, I've had to tone down some traits. What, like? Um, it was personal, isn't it? Um, just... Uh, I used to I, I used to strop off quite a lot. Mm. Like I I've seen my mum an ex but strop her off for her, just FYI and I've kind of like learned from her through osmosis. So mm. when things weren't going quite my way I'd just be like, <laughs> fuck the shit and just right. kind of walk away. Do you have a like a pattern of like strop face? It's well it's probably it's probably just my resting bitch face but times ten. So it's yeah. Right. Okay. Yeah, exactly. Mm. And then, and then I just kind of storm off wherever we were. And this has happened in many countries. When we're on holiday, I'm like, give a shit. I'm still storming off. Mm. So I have to tone down that because it's actually just unreliable. Mm. If I haven't got keys to somewhere, no, it's no. really annoying I now me. have to wait outside the house. I know. You did this. Steaming. Steaming. <laughs> so, um, yeah. That's a few, a few things. Yeah, I won't ask you, like, the other traits you have to... <laughs> yeah, are we... Yeah, yeah no. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's better off. Yeah. yeah. Well, As, um, do, you, do, you think, do you think that's the key thing? Like, both people have to make compromise? Oh, my God, 100%. I mean, you know, I think I think also the, the necessary... Th- I mean, I should talk to you about the, the, the one day you're on Two Housemates, but I don't think it's necessary. Just go and watch her in the first episode of Two Housemates Series 1. She's not in Series 2, unfortunately. She's the biggest but... creep in it, I'm like... No, way. Love, oh, come on. I you're, love you. You're besides the other creep. <laughs> You know, the one with his trousers down. <laughs> yeah. But in a sense of, like, in a sense of just a hierarchy of creepiness, it's not being like, oh, I'm not that much No, you're not creep. that much. I mean, you're still, still a creep. Still, I'm still but, a fucking you know. creep. <laughs> so, yeah. Great. Yeah. Well, like, you've, you've, uh, I'll, I'll try and, uh, now that I'm getting into the important stuff, we also have to leave in, like, 15 minutes. So, yeah, okay. Yeah, and I need to, like, take these contact lenses up. Oh, yeah. Pointless. I'm For not even sure. 100% sure I'm giving you eye contact. <laughs> no, no, you so, are. Oh, I am. You are now. Am. What about now? <laughs> I'm, I'm still not sure you're here. <laughs> I'm just kind of not helping you in any way. If no. I stand here, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Like you've you've done incredibly. Um, but I I need to say this because when I when I have these feelings, I have to say them on camera because it proves that I'm a nice person. No, I just I have to tell you, and I I've, I've trapped you here. I'm incredibly proud of how well you've done with your acting career at the moment. You're doing incredibly well, so well done. Um, when's it ending? <laughs> when's it stopping? <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Currently, like, <laughs> we're going to the stop now. Like uh, no, because. You you've done incredibly well. Is there a sort of like um like a, a like a tip or anything, or would you say like it's it's all down to luck and like being in the right place at the right time, or do you not feel as if you've done as well as I'm saying you've done? Yeah, yeah, I think I'm a little bit like that. Yeah. Where I'm like, do you know what? Like, because I knew you'd feel that way. Because I remember every single time that I speak to you about your acting, you're very instantly go, oh, it's not that special anyway. Tell me about what you're doing. <laughs> I don't want to talk about so me. Oh, sounds so posh. Sorry. <laughs> so horribly <laughs> posh. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I don't know. I, yeah, I think, I mean, like, in all seriousness, I'm like, I, I, I don't, and also, I mean, like, I'm very aware that I think, as you probably know, you get paid to do it. I think that's mm. incredible, like, whatever, yeah, it, yeah, wh- yeah. whatever it is. Mm. Um, and, yeah, but also, 
I mainly just playing creeps or prostitutes, so it's kind of also known for that. But yeah, but I mean, like, because when, when we did Housemate, that was so much fun because, as we've just talked about before, where the control aspect of, like, people, and, like, also the fact that you were like, do you like this bit? And, and like, the fact that if I was like, no, I don't really understand, we could then... Ch Change like, it. Yeah, and, like, that, yeah. obviously, that just kind of barely ever happens. So, mm. the bloody autonomy of doing stuff and then getting to that you know and liking it, it's like, I think that's so unbelievably underrated. It's, it's um, yeah, I think that that's also, as you know, where then you can um, actually have time to do mm. stuff. So do you, do you feel as if you've accomplished more when you've made something of your own than when you're actually um, like doing something for TV? I think there's something where, um, well, like, so... Um, this is probably very late <laughs> into moving the camera. Right. But, yeah. yeah. Um, well, look, like, so when... So my dad, we did a short... We made a short film a, um, a few weeks ago. Mm -hmm. And um, basically, he was like, I need somebody who's a bit bossy. Who can boss everybody about. And I was like, 100% there. Yeah, yeah. Um, and there was something where, like, even though it was only a few days, but it was, like, obviously the whole way through the day, um, at the end of it, there was something very, as you probably know, you just feel... Sorry. Thanks. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> um, you feel very, like... Oh man, like that was what we all did. Like yeah. we, we set everything up, we made it, all the food, we then packed everything away. And like, and obviously, mm. God, that's so easy still. But like, there's something very kind of when you can own it a bit more. Is, yeah. is there's something really lovely about that. And then like, my dad will say, "Well, I'll send this stuff over and let me know what you think if it's edited right." And you're like, mm. you never get to to do that sort of stuff. Yeah, yeah. So that aspect, I think, there was a much more kind of. Um, Were you also acting in it, or were you just no, no, just being, oh, wow. just being big. Big bossy boots. Big balls, yeah. No, no big balls as well, <laughs> just horribly bossy boots. Yeah. And my dad was like, ugh, mm. it's procreated <laughs> you. Um, but um, but no, and that was kind of lovely. So I think I think and, and I'm sure you've experienced this when you when you can go, look, that's all mine. That's all everything everything there is what I have said yes to. Yeah. Um, there's something kind of very lovely about that. Yeah. Is it, is that something you'd like to do more? Yeah, I think. Um, I mean, not kind of, not not the writing and things. Don't know how to no. write my own fucking name, but like I think it is. I think the AD part of it I love as well. Oh wow! Lot. Yeah. First um, AD, second AD. Yeah, mainly just because I'm a bossy boots. Okay, yeah, even yeah. Even though like it sounds like that sounds so like ooh, I should not. But it just no, no, no. Some, it just it, it it does it for you. It does. Yeah. It, it makes me tick. Yeah, yeah, sure. yeah, yeah. Um. You I, get that tingle. I get that tingle. Everybody else on set hates that tingle. Yeah. <laughs> But I get that tingle. <laughs> so. I love the tingle. <laughs> so, um, but that's yeah. I really, I really love that. And mm. um, and that's just something I'm sure. Again, that you know where, in, when you're kind of in that department, you're there the whole time. Mm. And it kind of there's something where it's um, a much more collective. Where it's not like oh, we've got this actor just coming for two scenes and they're gonna fuck off again. Like there's something where you're like we're here yeah. all the time. Yeah, we all know what we're doing. And yeah. Yeah, yeah. Which I kind of really enjoy. It feels less like you're a mercenary and more of you're just like actually hired to be there. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Um, yeah, so I think that's something, but mm. no, I don't know. We'll see if my dad ever wants to see me again. <laughs> uh, she bought me around. <laughs> <laughs> don't really. um, yeah. But, um, yeah. What would you, um, if, if somebody would come up to you and be like, no, I won't do the action. I'm sure Joseph Young. I'm sure Joseph Young. Um, I have you on Facebook. Um, are we in love yet? Um, <laughs> uh, if somebody come up to you and be like, "Hey, um, I want to, I want to become an actress," um, what would, what would you say to them? Don't I don't need the competition or? <laughs> Can you imagine? <laughs> um, uh, well, so my best mate, okay, um, so she's been to drama school. She graduated this year, and there have been the most amazing stories about that. Mm. So I think. Oh, don't worry about that. It's just a war. It's just a war. We live. <laughs> it's a casual war. It's just a casual war. Yeah, yeah. South West London. Um, um, and so I would say, and she, and she has also adamantly said, there's bad things about it, but the the sheer amount that you learn, and also for me, the main thing is the community that you get. Mm. Like you get this yog, and I like you and me both know that we don't have that. Like no, you have no. to kind of like either school friends or you meet people or whatever. Mm. But that sort of community, I think, is. Um, the best thing about it. Right. Like, okay, so I would probably say... Go that. to drama school. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. But I don't know. I don't know. It just seems like a good idea. It seems like it a seems sensible to, yeah, idea. Yeah, it seems like a sensible idea. Yeah. Yeah, okay, cool. I mean, by the time this goes out, hopefully 
it's still old. Um, not that I'm saying, you know, what you're in is shit. What I'm saying is it takes me ages to edit. Um, sure. Yeah, yeah. So you're, you're currently in a BBC show which is coming out on the 3rd of April. Oh, my God. How do you know that? I looked on your own, DB. Oh, um, my God. <laughs> what, do you remember what it's called? Home Fires. Home Fires. <laughs> She's in Home Fires. Uh, which is on the BBC, and you can watch that. She's very good, and I've seen the trailer. I was oh like, my oh, God. Lila. Every single time I see you on te- telly, even if I see you twice in the same trailer, I go, there's Lila. Um, Lila Mimic, thank you. I've got to stop saying your whole name. It just feels nice. Does it? Lila Mimic, yeah. Okay. I mean, sure. for the first six months of our friendship, I used to call you Layla. But that's besides the oh point. Oh my God, yes. Yeah, yeah, I'm really the sorry dark days. The dark days. Yeah, 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 yeah Where yeah. you used to tolerate me. <laughs> He says Layla, but I just, I just don't have the heart to tell him. No, zero heart. Yeah. Um, well, thanks, Sean. Thank Jessica. you very much. Do you, Great. Do, you, do you use the Twitters or anything? Not really. I don't really mm. understand. But Okay, well, if you find her on Twitter, <laughs> give her a follow or something. She's a delightful human being. She's one of my favourite people. Sure. Like, easily. Thank you so much. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Oh, and I'm showing them what we're working with. <laughs> That shit show. <laughs> that <bionic Yeah>. <laughs> I don't think I'm a type anyway. Yeah. You do have quite the big lips. <laughs> Brilliant. Mm. Like airbags for your face. Mm. Mm.